we have had a couple of exciting days to report here from our life with Onyx, our motorhome. And we had our first mobile tech out yesterday from ProTech. We have discovered some issues with what we thought was our um, Anderson valve. Perhaps it is only the water pump that needs to be replaced. So we will see what's, what's happening with that. We've also had a problem with our front air conditioning unit and the compressor was shot, so the AC needs to be replaced as well. So both of these parts are now being ordered. All right. If you would, check one more time. As you can see, the good people from ProTech came back today and brought us a brand new AC, which we didn't even know that came in, and change out the water pump on this side of the coach. So today we're getting a brand new AC, a brand new water pump, and hopefully this fixes all of our problems and we should be good to go. Kicking on out. Kind of easy to get to. Some are, some not. Yeah. Yep. She is, huh? Yeah. Um, you might gotta have a little bit of water in here because it's water on the line, so you know. Yep. Yeah. Some wood, some other ones, um, um, aluminum. Yeah. And they don't last. Right. See, it's already gushing out the bottom, so we're good. Yeah. Yeah. You. Just one more. Plenty of drain holes. It's gonna explain it to me what was going on. What happened is you have a well when stretch money. You have a check valve inside the pump. Mm. It's supposed to be going one direction and it starts from feeding back. So when that pressure valve goes out in there, it zip water back into the tank. That's what happens. It yes. fills up the. Uh, yes. Normally, this is what's going on. Normally, when the pump goes bad, this is what you get. So, this is what we always go for the pump. Perfect. That I didn't right know there, that. normally, the main problem with this now is leak. Yeah, I don't see a leak, but it's just filling up the uh, travel tank on the other side when we're on city water. Yeah. Because the pressure goes from one side. You see all that water coming out? Yeah. You still have pressure from one side. I got you. And it's then the, we call it vacuum breaker, stopping it. We're bleeding back and it sits back and it slowly slowly you can't get it. It's a The red is black. You follow me? Yeah. So this is how it's wired from the factory. This is how we're gonna wire because a lot of people get confused because they say red go red, black go gotcha. black. It doesn't, and not in this case. I just want to show you before we cut the wires and all this stuff. So I'm gonna leave it like that so you can see the color core on, okay? Satisfied? Actually, I'm sweating and feeling good. It's blowing cold air? Good deal. Brand new one's better. Huh? Brand new one's better. <laughs> good. See the water marks? Oh yeah, right here. Filled up. Yeah, it's leaking through the pressure switch. See all that? Yeah. We 
hope you enjoyed this video. A little bit something different. So when you do need a mobile RV tech, we can only recommend ProTech if you're ever in the area here of Central Florida. Super nice guys. Um, can't say nothing bad about them. Responsive, got the parts really quick and came back out and fixed our two main issues. They have been resolved now. Send us a thumbs up if you like this video. Check out our website at roadnotesrv.com. You can find us on all the usual social media outlets like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, also on rvillage.com. If you're new to our channel, go ahead and subscribe by clicking this red little subscribe button. Hit the bell so you can be notified of upcoming videos from us which come out every Friday. Leave us a comment if you have any questions or want to add anything to it. Always love to hear from you. Everybody stay safe. We'll see you in our next video. Take care. Bye.